What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another new video. Uh, today, in honor of the uh, World Juniors, just starting up today, it's Boxing Day when I'm filming this. Uh, Team Canada plays Czechoslovakia tonight. I figured in honor of the World Juniors happening right now, we do another box of uh, CHLs. This will be the third box I've done. Uh, I figured in honor of the World Juniors here, we do a little bit of Bedard hunting, uh, maybe some Shane Wright hunting, although obviously Bedard is the better guy to go for here. Some of the other guys that are on the team will uh, try and find them. And yeah, I had some decent luck with this stuff. The first two boxes I did, I pulled a uh, nice Sebastian Casa, who was Team Canada's goalie last year, actually. Didn't realize at the time for some reason. I didn't clue into that, but he was our goalie on the uh, summer winning team, I believe. Pulled a nice autograph of him. Pulled the Bedard's draft class card, which was worth more than that, even though it's an insert, but not like a super short print one. But that's just the Bedard tax. It is what it is. So anyway, so yeah, uh, if you want like a more in-depth review on this stuff, check back to one of those older videos. I sort of go over a little much more in-depth of what's in here and what you can pull. So this video will just uh, open her up and see what's in here. But um, real quickly, 16 cards per pack, 12 packs in the box. Uh, autographs are not guaranteed. They're one in every 24. So basically one, one in two boxes, you can get one. I've been lucky the first two boxes did have autographs in them. One, like I said, was that Kosa autograph, which was really nice. Kosa, Kosa, whatever you call them. And the uh, second one was not so good. Just sort of a lesser known player. So, which is what can happen with these boxes. The ceiling is super high being Bedard and the floor obviously is real low being a uh, pretty wide gamut of CHL players that end up, you know, CHLs as far as they sort of go in their career. But you never know, you get some cool guys, hang on to the card, they might pan out. So anyway, uh, yeah, honor the World Juniors. Open up another box of CHL here. Big up to actually the first game I watched so far was uh, Switzerland and uh, Finland, which was an upset. Switzerland beat them three two, which is good to see. Always like to see one of the favorites go down when it's not Canada. No upsets against Canada, please. So I said in the first two videos, I'll say it again. My CHL knowledge getting better, but still what I would say lacking. So I'll screw up some of these names, especially if they're the first time I've ever read them. Usually the teams, I know what the teams are, but it's the the names, especially if some of the import players, they they can get me sometimes. All right, number one, says so 16 cards per pack. So you get quite a bit, uh, fairly big base set. And if you're a base set guy, you get a ton of base cards. So base set collectors will love this stuff. All right, so we got... What is this Weef Splat? Weef Splat or V Splat? I still don't know. The other thing is that uh, the real good cards I found out are sleeved. So if you open a pack and you've got a sleeved card, you basically already know you've got something pretty good. So uh, Oasis Weef Splat, Charles Edward Gravel, Gravel or Gravel, Brady Burns, Samuel Johnson, William Trudeau, got uh, Cameron Tol Tolnay, Tolnay, Lucas Edmonds, a star rookie of Cameron Allen on the Guelph Storm. And I got the next step here, upside down. So Chase Stillman, Peter Ropitz. So that's just a non-numbered, non-numbered die-cut insert. And we got Josh Bloom on the Saginaw Spirit. Max McHugh, Neil Cro Nile, Neil or Nile, probably Nile Crocker. Aiden De La Gorgandier, so Blades captain there. Luca Verro, Sean McGurn, and Tag Bertuzzi. Tag Bertuzzi, who I believe is a relation of the other Bertuzzis. Well-known Bertuzzi's. So overall, I like this product, actually. You know, I mean, I don't know how much I would really like it if it wasn't for the Bedard factor. It's a cool product. You get a lot of cards, and I do like uh, learning some of these guys' names so when you see them again, like next year or in draft class or whatever, you sort of have an idea of who they are. Heard their names before. So Riley, Riley Ginnell, Israel Manscum, Julian Hiber, Tyler Bauer, Ronan Seeley, the Sevalod Gatamac, Amadeus Lombardi, Tucker Tynan, so you see the Greyhounds, a star rookie there of Ben Buhold from the London Knights. Uh, we've got a two star rookies. So we got a star, a star rookie and then a star rookie. So one of these is like a, this I believe is like a retro, I think. Anyway, Cold Miller, Zach Stringer, Blake Swetlikoff, Simon Pinard, Brandon Coey, favorite jerseys, the battalion, uh, Evan Konyan, and Christopher Sadoff. Sadoff or Sadoff. So you are guaranteed, I think you usually get a clear cut. It's a star rookie clear cut, I believe, someone. The Bedard Star Rookie Clear Cut would be the best one. Looks like the numbered card here. So exclusive, probably. So Tucker Robertson, Jack Thompson, Logan Doniak, Tyson Greenway, Nolan Meyer. Blaze goalie that year. I don't believe he's there anymore. It might be. I can't remember. Jake Caraballa, uh, Casper Larson. Stars there of Josh Bloom. And so there's our numbered card. So to 10. Interesting. All right. So gold to 10 of William Trudeau. So that's the high gloss there. The Charlottetown Islanders. So a low-numbered card there. I don't know if he's uh, anything special or not there, but always nice to hit sort of a low-numbered card. So low-numbered gold to 10. I mean, the fact that they didn't put a sleeve on it, which I know they will do if they really like a really highly regarded card gets sleeved, maybe it's not that special. But there you go, to 10. That's cool. That, I believe, may be one of the, the box hit. I'm not sure. Braden Hatch, Gannon Larocque, and Nolan Ritchie, Ty Cartier. Cards whenever we're here. Ivan Ivan. I freaking love Ivan Ivan. Best name. Braden Sherman. And Matteo Bertondi. So if I ever screw up Ivan Ivan, God help me. All right, so we got our numbered card. We should still hit a clear-cut rookie, I believe. Zach Bigger. Luke McNamara. Ryan Stepien. Mitchell Russell. Julian Rod. Reese Vitelli. A star rookie of Gavin Hayes. On the Flint Firebirds, so you got a CHL profiles. 
I'm Tyler Brennan on the Prince George Cougars. So it's a die cut card there. Die cut CHL card. And we got Dylan Grant. I think we got three of those. Mark Pedreau, Braden Kessler, William Villeneuve, Jagger Furcus, probably my favorite name in the whole set. Jagger Furcus on the Moose Jaw Warriors. Martin Kromiak, Matthew Ward from the Swiftman Broncos, and Arden Grishnikov. These were $89.99 the local card shop, by the way. No box day sale or anything, just a normal price. That was there on Boxing Day. I was hoping to find something. They didn't really have any good deals on cards, is what it is. Lucas Siona, Colton Dock, that is Kirby Dock's younger brother. Maxim Perlin, Thomas Couture, Nicholas Hurtubis, or Hurtubis, still haven't found out exactly how you say that. Hurtubis, anyway. Fabio Iacobo, or Iacobo, Matthias Sapovalev, I guess. Uh, star rookie of Dylan McKinnon, Halifax Mooseheads. Also, don't believe there's any relation there to uh, all this other McKinnon. I don't think so. And then we got another Halifax Moose head. There's uh, Jordan Demay, Jordan Demay, star rookie. And you got Bryce Montgomery, Connor Lockhart, Jackson Berezowski, Rhett Melnick, Cohen Zimmer, Bo Aki, and Servak Petrovsky. One of those draft class cards should be coming as well. Elliot Denoyer, J.R. Avon, Kyle Jackson, George Diaco. Michael Gutt, Matthew Papes, Sergei Litvinov, a star rookie of Ryder Korjak, another star rookie there of Evan Nose or Naus from the Ramparts, Jonathan Fouchon, Pacey Schluting, Jordan Gustafson, Louis Philippe Fontaine, Ryan Francis, Mike Patizian, and William Blackburn. Just realizing I, I haven't pulled a uh, I haven't pulled a darn base card either, which is kind of crazy. Maybe its base cards are also shorter printed. Jack Mattier, Mattier, Gabe Clausen. Uh, Tom Cadu, looks like we see a shiny card there. It's probably a, our draft class card. Jordan Frasca, Ethan Del Mastro, uh, Ivan Zhigalov, William Viet, a star rookie of David Goyette, and first draft there of Tristan Bertucci. So Tristan Bertucci on the Flint Firebirds. So NHL or OHL priority selection. Vaughn, Ontario there. So a nice shiny card. I like those cards. Then we got Pascal Zito, Maxim Warner, Denton Matichuk, Artem Guriev, Cole McKay, Matt Vey Petrov and Paul Hughes. Like I said, this is a card I pulled a uh, Bedard one of these. Like I said, they're not not signed, not numbered, not nothing, just an insert, and they sold it for over hundred bucks. So, the Bedard tax is a real thing. Definitely, I, I wanted to open some of the World Junior stuff, uh, but last year's stuff because of Bedard is super expensive, and of course, new stuff isn't out yet. I'm pretty sure it comes out after World Junior, so uh, we opening some of that when we can. Try and pull a Bedard out of that too, but for the time being, it's it's this is our best bet. Miguel Torjani, Daniel Michaud. Connor Bouchard, Connor Bouchard, not to be confused with Connor Bedard, Keaton Doniak, Stefan Machisek, it's probably going to say that, Tyler Palmer, Anton Thornton, uh, star rookie of Maxime Corsal, yeah, Maxime Corsal, uh, here's our star rookie clear cut, so we always get one of these, of Brant Clark, Barry Colts in this picture, camera really hates this thing, so Barry Colts in this particular picture, he was drafted by uh, LA, so he's, uh, I think he's actually played a few games with LA, um, I think he's on the rain right now, he may be on the world junior team too actually, let me see if he actually made the World Junior team. The name sounds familiar. He's playing on Team Canada as well, so that's a cool one to pull right there. So drafted defenseman playing in the World Junior, so I can't complain about that. So there's Clark, Brad Clark, like I said, on the very Colts back when this picture was taken, but now he plays for LA or the Rain, depending if he's up or down. And we got Ethan Caldwell, Angus McDonald, Angus, great name, Theo Rochette, uh, Remy Poirier, Remy Poirier, Connor Fernetti, Ethan Kruger, and Logan Crosby. That's crazy. The Mooseheads, at least at this point, had a McKinnon and a Crosby on the, on the team at the same time that I don't believe were related. All right, so I don't know what's left here. We got our exclusive. We got our clear cut. I think that's sort of it for guaranteed stuff, so. All right, so we got Justin Robida. We got Jacob Melanson, Isaac Beliveau, Carter Serienko, Mark Olivier Beaudry, Craig Armstrong, Jacob Hoosier, Hoosier, Hoosier. Uh, Connor Roulette, star rookie, and oh, we did get a, an autograph. All right, cool. So three for three on our autographs, which are not guaranteed. So Drew Krebs, the Medicine Hat Tiger, so WHL are there. So he had 30, 66 games played, four goals, 15 assists, so not exactly a superstar. But 176 overall by the Washington Capitals, so he's a Capitals draft pick, so drafted guy, playing for the, still playing for the Tigers, so he's the assistant captain this year, so he's been playing. And similar stats to last year, three goals, 15 assists, so um, actually, no, he's on pace to do better this year. Last year, he had four goals, 15 assists. He's already matched his assist total in 34 games plus a goal so there's Krebs so Capitals prospect so yeah not a bad one obviously a Bedard auto is a big big one but at least this is, uh, this is as far as I'm concerned this is a better name than my last auto so we will take that and then behind him we had Connor Trenholm Josh Pillar Josh Pillar Pillar Loic Digg Josh Philman, Kyle McDonald, Lachlan Gordon, and Fabrice Fortin. All right, well, now with that, we should be getting at least two more CHL profiles inserts, I think, and maybe another first draft class or like a, 
Uh, what's it called? The other die cut ones. Next step, I think. Probably one of them. All right, Landon Cozier, Mark LaJoy, Ethan Peters, Declan McDonald, Jeremy LaPointe, Aubrey Hayes, Daniel, Daniel Cheka, Vincent Gauthier, a star rookie of Kerry Terrence. Yeah, next step, okay. So next step of it, Dylan Ginther from the Edmonton Oil Kings. And we got Nolan Bentham, Tyler Kozak, Dawson Stairs, uh, Tyler Brennan, Evan Say, and Brady Stonehouse. All right, Jacob Brook, Tyler Austin, Kevin Korczynski, Braden Holt, not to be confused with Braden Holt B, Felix LaFrance, Brett Brissett, we got Sean Tishkirl, Hunter Height, star Ricky, and first draft class of Nick Lardis. Peterborough Peets, Peterborough Peets, it's kind of a tongue twister apparently, on the Peterborough Peets, not sure if he's drafted or not, but there you go. And we got Graham Sward, Logan LeSage, Alex Drover, Vincent LaBelle, Carl Tetachuk, Colson Petra Petrie. And Mateo Lalama. All right, last pack. 2021-22 CHL. Daniel Sobolov, Vincent Iorio, Pavel, Pavel Novak, Logan Barlage, Ben King, Jacob Gauthier, Elias Cohen, a star rookie of Callum Ritchie from the Oshawa, from the Oshawa Generals. Uh, CHL profiles of Gavin Hayes. So that's our last profiles. We were due for one. Zachary Giroux, Logan Morrison, Jacob Mayette, 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 Skylar Bruce, Rhett Reinhardt, Obi Saganak, Riley Piercy, and Talon Boyko. And for recap, we didn't really have anything really worth noting in the uh, star rookies, so we'll just skip that. Uh, CHL, Gavin Hayes from the Flint Firebirds. So we got a couple of first draft class cards here. So Nick Lardis, Trent Bertucci. Like I said, the Bedard was one of these, best one of these cards I've pulled. And then uh, we got the next step. I feel like he's drafted. I think he has to be drafted to be on these next step cards. I could be wrong on that one, though. And then uh, Tyler Brennan, so goalie on the profiles card. And we got our... Exclusives to 10, which is nice. I believe there's also exclusives to 100, so hitting a 10 is nice. Of William Trudeau, the Charlottetown Islanders there. Um, nothing special based on his numbers there. Yes, he's he's a defenseman, so really those are decent numbers for a defenseman, so I should cut him some slack there. I mean, harder on him than I thought. Based on those numbers, decent defenseman. And then Brad Clark, our uh, clear cut here. He's uh, drafted Washington Capital, um, currently playing for Team Canada, so that's pretty good. My phone obviously hates this card. There we go. So, Brad Clark. Uh, yeah, look for him. Look for him while playing the World Juniors right now. So kind of fitting to pull a world junior player. And then Drew Krebs, Madison Hat Tiger. Not uh, just a base card, though. Decent signature. Nothing crazy. At least it's a full name and his number, which is always cool. So so right on. All right. So in honor of the world juniors, another box in the, in the books. Of, uh, another box of CHL in the books. Didn't hit right. Didn't hit Bedard. Uh, still some cool cards, though. You're not going to hit those guys every time. So is what it is. But yeah, in honor of the world juniors, thought it'd be fun to open that. You always hit some decent cards. It's always fun to get an auto, especially because I wasn't. You're not guaranteed to get an auto. And so far, I'm three for three. So I'll take that. So, uh, yeah, if you like this kind of content, maybe you want to see me do some more Bedard hunting, let me know in the comments. Uh, my LCS still has a few boxes. I feel like it's probably the same case, and I feel like that Casa card that I hit was sort of like the case hit for that. That Bedard card could have been a case hit. I don't think it is, but it's worth enough value for this stuff. It could have been a case hit. So I could do it some more of that, but let me know. And if you like the content, like what I'm doing, feel free to subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, do all that usual YouTube stuff, and we'll see you in the next one.